Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another personal type video. So, today I'm going to be looking back at some old footage, and when I say old footage, I mean really old footage. Like, we are fraternising with the dinosaurs today, my friends. An old fossil dug up from the very depths of one of my hard drives. Today I was looking for a very specific photo, and I was checking a hard drive that I had a feeling it might be on, and I discovered some footage from a test clip I did before an audition tape. So, a bit of backstory for those of you who may not have seen my Static Yonder Iceberg video where I talk about the Jojo lore. Might be worth you checking that out if you haven't already, by the way. Basically, from about age 10 to age 15, I was home educated or homeschooled or whatever you want to say. And the reason was severe bullying. I used to get the living shit kicked out of me. It wasn't just me. There was a group of me and some friends who wouldn't even say sensitive, just more, you know, empathetic and normal functional human beings in the school. And there were a certain group of kids in our year group and the year above that didn't take well to that. And so they used to pick on us. And I'm not talking normal school, you know, kids will be kids type thing. I'm talking severe beatings, like beatings. And it wasn't good. So I had to be pulled out in my last year because it got so bad. Fast forward to about four years after that, through being homeschooled, I had the opportunity to pursue my acting career, which I'd started whilst I was in school. As you all know, I'm a very creative person. Back then, acting was my wheelhouse. I didn't want to be behind the camera. I didn't want to make movies. I didn't want to be a musician. I wanted to be an actor. I would say I still do. I still do acting, even on my channel. But today, I do filmmaking as a whole and music too, which I had no desire to do back then. Again, being homeschooled gave me the chance to use extra time that I may not have had at school to pursue auditions and so on and so forth and that's what brings us to today's video so this clip is from when i was 13 years old this would have been summer 2014 so nine years ago and i was recording a clip with my mum before we did an audition tape to make sure that the camera was working and i thought i'd do this video today because it's good to look back when a person is invested in themselves and looking to improve themselves every day, I think it's important we look back to see where we started and see how far we've come. And it's like boiling a frog, self-improvement. You don't realize it's happening until it's happened. And the only way to know how far you've come is to look back and see the contrast. So before my camera battery runs out, let's get onto it. Uh, instantly we are greeted with a face that looks nothing like it does now. Back then I had a bit, mo bit more weight on me, I was into my video games, very sedentary life. I wasn't lazy, I was just sedentary. All my habits pointed towards the weight gain. People used to bully me for that then as well. It just proves that anyone will take the piss out of you for anything they can if they're so inclined. Doesn't matter how good a person you are, they will always find a flaw because they are that petty. But I was chubby. Anyway, let's get on to it. That's how old this file is. It's taking forever to just function. I random stuff. I have, I have, I have something made of silver foil. <laughs> I still do stupid shit like that. Anyway, uh, so today this is just a test before I do the script thing of my what's it, whatever. Thing of my what's it. Yep. Good word. Do I press red again? To stop yes. it. What a way to end a video. There you are. That's that's what I used to be like. And that's creepy because it feels like it could have been yesterday and yet it was so long ago. Wildly, interestingly, even though I hadn't even cracked five foot in this video, I my voice had started to break by this point, which is quite interesting. I know I've become infamous now for hitting all the high notes in heavy metal songs and stuff like that, but my voice by definition is not actually high. If you were to look at my speaking voice on a spectrograph or whatever right now, you would see it is in sort of the baritone register. The high notes are an ability, not the default. So that was the, the one thing about me that I had before anybody else. Even though I was that short, my voice had already started to break and started to become a man's voice. And it's just very interesting to see what I was like. Because again, I was short, chubby, but yeah, it, it's just an interesting contrast. and. I'm putting myself out there today with this video to prove to you all that it is doable. Whatever you want to do with your life, however you want to change yourself, however you want to live, you can do it. I can do it. I did it. Here's the evidence. And it's always important to see how far we've come. 
I, I think I was kind of cute looking back. Like, back then, I hated myself. I used to look in the mirror and detest what I looked like. But you know what? In hindsight, it wasn't that bad. I was just letting bad voices get in on my mind. And that is the worst thing you can do, is give them power. So, yeah, that's today's video. Just found a piece of footage, and I thought I'd show you all what I used to look like. Because the videos on my channel from back at that sort of time are all me behind the camera playing video games. It's just so funny. Like, some things have changed drastically, but... I have something made of silver for like I still make silly anecdotes like that. Age 22. And it's just wild. It's crazy. Look at that face. Look at the utter disgust behind those eyes. Look at the pure disgust in this man's face. Right here. <laughs> yeah, it's great. So, anyway, that was today's video. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.